Hey, hey, welcome back to the Suffer City Training Center. My name is Jason here at Suffer City. Today we're talking about a fantastic therapeutic exercise here, what are called oftentimes articulations or subscap pulls. We're gonna be working through the back side of the shoulder, a lot of the underlying support features of the shoulder, such as your rotator cuff muscles. So what I'm gonna do is get a good, strong, elastic band here. Uh, you don't necessarily need a band, but it definitely helps to have this type of a band for this particular movement. And I'm gonna start to set my hips way back. Now I wanna to start to feel some stretch all the way from where my lat sort of originates here, way down, way down near the lower end of my spine. And then I wanna feel that stretch all the way up into the connecting point up into my shoulder here. So I'm gonna allow that stretch to happen for a little while. And now what we're gonna do is start to take these what are called, again, articulations. Because what's happening here is I'm getting a lot of movement through my shoulder, but I'm not bending the elbow. And that's a key feature here when taking these movements is that you keep the elbow fully extended and just move through that shoulder. And you can see a lot of the activity through the shoulder capsule, the backside, the subscapular muscles that uh, make up your rotator cuff are getting a lot of activity here. And it's activity that they oftentimes are neglected from because we're so oftentimes using those big motor units or the prime movers of the shoulder as well as the lat. But if we don't attend to some of these smaller supportive synergistic muscles like our rotator cuff, then what's gonna happen is they'll start to take on some undue stress and they won't have the strength and function to absorb it. So this tool here is fantastic with a horizontal pull using the band. Let's say you don't have a band or you wanna do a two-handed, kind of a slightly more challenging option. We're gonna have a hanging articulation or again called our subscap pulls. So you can find yourself hanging from a pull-up bar now. We got to get a full hang. I'll even take a couple breaths here to really let my body elongate, let the muscles stretch. And once I'm there, I'll get a good grip on this bar and just simple pulls right back down, right back up. Again, notice the elbows stay fully extended all the way through the movement. Now, if I want to bring my feet forward a little bit, that'll activate a little bit more core. But in particular here, we're focused on the shoulders and the supporting structure of that shoulder capsule. So again, this is a great tool, the subscap pulls or your articulations. Give them a shot to support that sh uh, shoulder. Until next time, my name is Jason, go be great.